Morning, Saturday, June 8th. I am out for another pick on the interchange where I was working last time. Hopefully to get to the other side of where I was. Uh, it's much warmer today. It's early, I'm getting out before the heat really kicks in. It's gonna be in the 80s today, I think, uh, which is hot for around here. But uh, I'm gonna show you something as I walk in there. It's gonna give me a second to get there. But uh, when I first started walking this area or getting there, it was no problem getting close to it. Now, as the the, the year has gone on and the blackberries have grown it's getting to be quite a challenge so I'll just show you what it's like to walk to get to the pick and sometimes that's the hardest part is just walking <laughs> or getting close enough parking close enough so that you can actually do the pick without burning all your energy walking back and forth so uh, especially around ones around major roads and things that's where the challenge is so I'm gonna walk a little bit and then uh, I'll wait for some fire engines to go by and I'll catch you in a minute so when I came through here a couple weeks ago, this was wide open all the way, about this wide, maybe a little wider. Uh, when I get a little farther up here, you can see what the challenge is. vines like this that weren't here a month ago none of this was here a month ago okay you get the idea I'm gonna put the camera down but this is what I have to fight my way through now just to get to the litter anyways I'll catch you a little later okay just before I leave the spot Got that whole side clean. Six bags down there, plus some big items. I'll wrap it up when I get back to the car. Wrapping up for the day, back to the car. That was about two and a half hours round trip, maybe two and three quarter. Uh, I'll be the last pick in that area for this year, just because I won't be able to get back to it. The black, blackberries coming back, I swear they had grown another six inches to a foot in between the time I was there and the time I, or the time I went in and the time I came back. So. But the good news is I finished up both sides of that uh, side of the interchange. So I'll be moving on to other areas here in the near future, figuring out. Still want to finish up along the highway where I was picking earlier this spring, get back into that. Uh, and then this interchange obviously has three more sides to it. One side I've done before and then the whole other side I haven't. So get into that and get there. Um, maybe we'll see. I got to find a place to park again. Like I said, have to half the challenge is getting close enough to park so that you don't have to haul everything a, a long way but at least the city's picking up the stuff for me on the good news side of things uh, we should have the mobile app by the time this app comes or by the time this video comes out the mobile app for Android and Apple will be out on the store so you can download that uh, we've also recruited a whole lot more volunteers to work on the mobile app and now the website again so we'll start kicking out some more updates to the website uh, around litter reports and some updates and uh, branding and logo and all kinds of stuff there. So uh, I was able to recruit a bunch of people through Reddit, which is awesome. Thank you, Reddit, for showing up. Uh, we'll get back in there and uh, get some more um, features added to the site. So my focus is going to turn from working on the mobile app. I'll let the other people work on the mobile app and the, and the, the website, but I'm going to dive into marketing and try to really build up what the brand recognition for Trash Mob. We've got some, some people I'm gonna to talk to this week. Start getting it out there. It's time, it's go time now. We've got all the platform that we need. We can always add more features, uh, but it's time to get out there and see if we can't raise the profile of this and get lots more volunteers. So if you're seeing this, and obviously you're seeing this, uh, but please like, subscribe, that helps our videos. Uh, but then start talking about Trash Mob with your friends if you like it. Uh, if you want to contact us, please do so. Info at trashmob.eco. You can reach out. Let's get it, get it going in your town, your city, uh, in your community. If you want to be a partner, please reach out to us. Uh, we'd love your help in any way. Uh, there's lots of different ways that we could use partnerships to, to raise the profile. 
to get going. Uh, I'd like to think we've made a huge difference already in my town where we've been doing this for the better part of two years now. You can really see the difference and uh, hopefully we can do that in even more communities. So anyways, have a great day. I'll catch you later. See ya.